Hello, uh, this is Mary Fromling with LSS Holdings. Welcome back to our weekly series. We took a few weeks off during the holiday break and we'd like to resume back. Uh, we appreciate your comments and your inquiries during that break. Uh, but we definitely want to um, get this back on track and address today uh, using UVC in manufacturing facilities. So let's get started. Just a reminder of who we are again, we are LSS Holdings. Uh, LSS Holdings has been in business for 16 years with Hughes Environmental providing nationally environmental facility cleaning, duct cleaning, ceiling and rafter cleaning, combustible dust remediation, with LSS Life Safety Services providing fire and smoke damper inspections and repair, fire and door inspections and repair, fire stopping and UVC lighting solutions, and launched this year, SafeNetics, the safety e-learning certification platform uh, providing technology application. UVC light disinfection is a germicidal UVC light and it uses short wave length ultraviolet light to kill and inactivate microorganisms, leaving them unable to perform vital functions. And we've been talking about this uh, technology and the science behind it for many weeks now, but we wanna talk specifically about how we use the light um, in disinfecting duct work, uh, sterilizing surfaces, and destroying harmful microorganisms in manufacturing. Uh, this is proven technology, very cost effective for food and beverage production, pharmaceutical manufacturing, semiconductor manufacturing, and production facilities. I mean, it's really unlimited. We're seeing not only in production and manufacturing, but in distribution as well. So why does this light work? Uh, UVC light has been used substantially in disinfecting water, air, products, and surfaces against bacteria, viruses, and microorganisms that can cause disease. UVC light disinfection is most often used with other technologies in a multi-barrier approach. This ensures that whatever microorganism is not destroyed by one method, such as cleaning, it is inactivated by another UVC lighting. And we see this in, uh, with Azure's recommendations about filter uh, sizes, and then coupling that with UVC. So recently, Azure increased their recommendations for filtration, and you combine that with UVC light and you have a very powerful combination for uh, disinfecting uh, air and surfaces in your facilities. So UVC light disinfection in HVA systems, we see that uh, increasing more and more across manufacturing as well as using uh, these innovative uh, handheld wands and mobile remote UVC disinfection systems and ceiling and wall mountable germicidal UVC systems. So uh, new products are being developed as we speak with these patented devices with uh, scientific data behind them are um, increasing in the marketplace and being brought out um, and put into to the businesses daily. So the World Health Organization uh, says approximately 30% of all commercial buildings have significant indoor air quality problems and ventilation systems and are implicated in the spread of infection and pollutants. And we see a lot of uh, news clippings right now about World Health, World Health Organization or the WHO. Um, and we see a lot of uh, better information about exactly what this this quote really does mean to all of us. UVC light disinfection and HVA systems on the coils. Let's talk about this. Um, these uh, systems are installed close to the coil. As you can see in this photograph, uh, they are close to the coil and they can help restore coil capacity. Um, so whether you're installing them in a brand new building as part of new construction or if you're installing them in an existing building, they can restore coil capacity. They have the ability to return HVAC systems close to the original system. Um, and they kill bacterial growth by shrinking biofilm on the coil. We've talked about that in other YouTube presentations, which you can go back and, and into our um, library and check out those messages on biofilm in HVAC systems. So the best uses for HVAC systems, let's just break it down. So you just saw a picture uh, on the last slide of the systems right on the coil. 
And this example is a rapid install kit for AHUs from light industrial to heavy commercial. Uh, the other examples that we can use are enhanced UVC kits, and these are ideal for air handler units typically found in a commercial and industrial applications. So look at the flexibility of these different products. Um, it's very easy to diagnose which will be the best fit once we understand what kind of system you have in place. We do need to have um, UVC questionnaire filled out, but it's very simple information that comes right off of um, any tags that you have on your system or any um, spec books that you may have from your construction or any type of uh, information that your maintenance team might have. Uh, the next example is single-ended UVC fixtures or what is better referred to as an SE series series for exterior units such as rooftop units, uh, heat pumps, fan coils, and package terminal units and ducts. So DE series for medium and large air handling units, and then unitary kits for air conditioners for indoor air handling with less than five tons. Uh, as well, um, not represented in a picture here, um, units are available for, um, and they're unitary kits, for PTAC units and other type of smaller units that you might see in hospitality or in systems where we don't have duct work available. So there are studies, lots of white papers that can be um, shared with you uh, by simply reaching out to us. But this EPA study um, was biological inactivation efficiency in HVAC in duct ultraviolet light devices. So this is the performance and results on the nine UVC devices where 99% efficient in inactivating the vegetative bacteria, so probably yeast in this, in this uh, example, uh, which can build up and grow, especially where food manufacturing or production is uh, present. Uh, three of these UVC devices were 93% effective for all three microorganisms, and five devices had 46% effect efficacy uh, for inactivation of the spore form of the bacteria, and then two devices had 46% efficiency in destroying the virus. We're including this slide today to just show you and remind you that um, there are superior products that are out there and there are um, inferior products that are out there. And when you're reviewing and analyzing the different systems to put into your facility, it's extremely important to understand um, who is using these, these devices and what type of results have they had and just how effective they are. So this Homeland Security research slide is extremely important because we do represent sterile air products in our projects and because they're six times more effective when tested against competitive lamps. So you see a lot of news clippings, you see a lot of advertisements out there. So uh, understand how effective the system is that you're evaluating and it's being quoted into your facility today and use this as your um, high water mark. So six times more effective than any of these other devices that you see. And this is just a small list. So let's talk about some of the different um, ways that we can use UVC and how it comes to you and how you can be more flexible. Uh, we have the fixed mounted systems, of course, but this is a great example of the handheld wand. And this is the tool that we would recommend when you need on demand decontamination, you need a portable. It does require electricity that the photograph does not show um, electricity, but simple regular electrical um, plugs are, not, are all that are needed. It's portable, it's easy to use, it's chemical free, it does not create ozone. None of the products that we're uh, recommending uh, create ozone. It's cost effective, it's the green alternative. All of these are actually the green alternative, but this is the on-demand uh, tool. And it um, weighs less than five pounds and the bulb lasts for one year or 9,000 hours, just like the other devices in the systems that we're talking about. So here's some other great examples of where we're seeing UVC handheld wands being used. So in food preparation processing and packaging, um, it's used to reduce pathogens such as coliform, salmonella, E. coli, staphylococcus, and listeria. Um, in laboratories and clean rooms, it's used to prevent cross-contamination. Again, these wands are on demand. We can easily plug them in, very limited amount of PPE, uh, a little bit of education on how to be safe with them, and we can be decontaminating an area very quickly. 
Um, it's also great on hard to reach and high touch surfaces, keyboards, doorknobs, and machineries. Uh, this is a loom or a printing press. And I think of um, all the printing and packaging that we're working on right now with flexographic packaging equipment. This gives your team control out in the field and gives them peace of mind and they're able to uh, perhaps decontaminate in between breaks or shift changes or perhaps there is a, a more immediate need to decontaminate an area but these UVC handheld wands are fantastic for that type of that situation. So also recommended is mobile remote UVC disinfection systems and these deliver the highest UVC output. Uh, they obviously have more bulb strength and they have more um, uh, coverage, surface coverage area, and they can provide 360 degree disinfection power and capability. Uh, they are portable where and when you need it and they are app enabled so that you can safely leave the room, use your phone, and then engage the equipment to be able to disinfect your area. So whether this is the boardroom, the break room, the bathroom, um, a switching room, um, uh, a research and development area. This is a very portable uh, piece of equipment and very powerful piece of equipment in addition to the indoor air quality systems on your air handling units. This gives you a lot of power uh, and very flexible. So here's some other great exa examples. So uh, full room sanitizing, uh, mold and bacteria control and food processing areas. We do uh, recommend that these are FDA, USDA approved. Um, and again, in laboratories and clean rooms to prevent cross-contamination. Very affordable too. Ceiling and wall mountable germicidal UVC systems are energy efficient. They too have 9,000 hours of usage and they kill mold, bacteria, and viruses where they lurk. Uh, they can mount flush in the ceiling or into the wall safely so that they can be used safely in these rooms and give you again more direct control on disinfection in addition to the air handling unit systems uh, when installed. So here's some other uh, best management practices where we're seeing ceiling and wall mounting systems using. So they're great for full room disinfection and sanitizing. There's some images there, maybe a distribution center, um, an aerospace center and food, um, food or retail or storage. Um, they also are great for disinfecting and sanitizing incoming and outgoing packages in shipping and receiving rooms is where we're seeing these being installed. So our UVC products are also ISO certified, UL certified in the Canada area and, and, and the US. These are just some of the uh, distinctions that we hold for this equipment. If you want to do more homework, and we appreciate the questions that are coming in and the due diligence that customers are um, uh, using when they're making their choices, it's, it makes your, um, your purchase that much more satisfying and defendable. You can check Facilities Net, Sterile Air, EPA, and International Ultraviolet Association, IUVA. Again, I want to thank you and everyone from LSS Holdings. We would like to thank you for your time as you spend with us on these messages weekly. Thank you again for the projects that continue to sustain us and help us grow as a life safety company. And we really appreciate any uh, uh, contact using our website, hughesenv.com or email info at hughesenv.com. And still 24 hours a day, seven days a week, our 800 number, 888-845-3952. If you require immediate attention for COVID-19 disinfection, um, or if you wanna discuss any of these products and services for your facility, please reach out to us on the website, email, or our 800 number. And thank you so much for making us a part of your life safety program. So be safe out there and have a great week. Thank you.